Welcome back to the second edition of our incredible houseboat series. I'm sure many of you have been dreaming of a peaceful getaway for some time now. Well, having a home on the water is perfect for doing just that. Plus, it means you get to take all of your creative comforts with you whenever you travel. This is the Interesting and Creative Designs channel, and here are six more incredible houseboats you might want to save up for in the future. Starting us off is this beautiful house boot design from Germany. Made to house up to four people, the living quarters cover an area of 22 square meters. There are plenty of areas to sit, either out on the deck or inside where you'll also find ample storage space. The furniture is sturdy yet functional, and you get a TV plus Wi-Fi connection. There's a kitchen area, complete with fridge and cooking facilities, And when it's time to get some rest, you have multiple sleeping areas to choose from. These include a double bed and two single beds. What's more, you can literally raise the roof of this houseboat to create some extra room. And on top, you have your very own garden space, perfect for sunbathing or stargazing. If you get bored of one location, simply turn on the engine and head somewhere new. This mobile abode is currently available to rent for around 220 euros per day, or 1500 euros per week. That's about 270 or 1800 US dollars respectively. Prices vary depending on the time of year you decide to book, but to make the most of this amazing houseboat and its rooftop garden, surely the summer months are when it's really worth having. Up next, off the coast of Dubai is where you're likely to find one of these magnificent floating seahorses. Touted as the world's first luxury underwater villa, these floating homes offer underwater bedrooms with marine life views, in addition to a sun deck with jacuzzi and outdoor dining area. They also dwarf our previous entry in terms of size, providing over 4,000 square feet, almost 372 square meters of living space. Its creators describe these homes as the epitome of timeless design and craftsmanship spread across three levels, including a spectacular underwater floor. In addition to the underwater experience, other unique state-of-the-art features include high-tech lighting and climate control, even in outdoor areas. Being a perfect combination of both engineering and imagination, you can bet that the price tag for one of these homes is astonishingly high. We're not sure exactly how much it is, as prices are only available upon request, though that in itself tells you that these living quarters are only for the high rollers. Now for something even bigger and probably even more expensive. This floating house from Miami-based company Arcup is more like a floating mansion. Current designs offer a sizable 4,350 square feet of living space and includes four bedrooms and four and a half bathrooms. Arcup are geared towards an avant-garde life on water. Their livable yachts are self-sufficient, sustainable, and environmentally friendly. Plus, they're available to own right now. The only catch is you have to be a millionaire to own one, as a fully furnished and decorated livable yacht is currently priced at five and a half million dollars. Still, if you can afford it, then it could be a fantastic investment. With sea levels rising along with city populations, living on the water could become a lot more common. These floating homes have hydraulic legs, which when deployed, make them just as sturdy as structures on land. 
Moreover, they've been built to withstand extreme weather conditions, including strong currents and hurricanes up to 155 miles per hour. Living off the grid is made easy thanks to self-contained solar-powered systems, and you can enjoy 270-degree panoramic views and plenty of sunshine. Of course, you could also change the view and move to a more agreeable climate whenever you wish. Sounds tempting, right? If you're looking for something a bit more traditional in style, only on water, then check out this home named The Tiny by Harbor Cottage. Despite its name, it's actually pretty spacious. It comfortably sleeps six people, providing two full beds, one twin and one king-size bed, in addition to a full bathroom complete with bathtub and shower. The first floor has a dimension of 575 square feet, while the second floor offers 364 more square feet of living space. There's also the option to add a loft. Once you're inside, other than some spectacular views out of the window, you'd be hard pressed to tell you were actually on water and not in a normal home. The full-size furnishings and appliances are expertly arranged to make the most of the space and include a microwave, refrigerator, dishwasher, washing machine, and dryer. Each so-called tiny houseboat cottage also comes with its own 12-foot by 16-foot front porch and a 10-foot by 16-foot covered rear porch that provides access to the roof deck. Speaking of which, the roof deck is the perfect place for hosting a get-together in the summer. It comes complete with a diving board, hot tub, rooftop bar, and even your very own slide. From houseboats to a rustic boathouse now. It's a subtle difference, I know, but this custom boathouse is more of a permanent fixture than the others on this list. It's still technically a home on the water though, and you can get around on any of the boats you own, which can be stored outside under the decking or in your very own boat garage. This place is gorgeous and an ideal retreat, holiday home, or place to settle down. It's surrounded by a majestic natural beauty, and the interior is just as much a breath of fresh air, with its high ceilings and open living spaces. Everything about this design oozes comfort, elegance, and serenity. Although, you can imagine it would also be a pretty awesome place for wealthy spring breakers to hang out and party every now and again. And last, but by no means least, we have the Overblue Houseboat. Now this definitely looks more boat than house, but you'd be surprised just how homely this thing is. I certainly wouldn't mind spending weeks, months, or even years on board. The large living environment contains all the amenities of a modern home, and the interior design is made for ultimate comfort and safety. The Overblue's open, airy living quarters are great spaces for friends and families to hang out. Plus, it allows you to move freely between the lounge and kitchen areas with ease. A unique and innovative on-the-water terrace allows sunshine and fresh breeze to enter the floating home. An electronic clamshell door opens at the push of a button and provides a private area to enjoy breakfast or a romantic evening drink. In the galley, there's an island bar with stools and everything you'd expect to find in an upscale kitchen including an oversized sink, electric oven, stand-up full-sized refrigerator freezer, microwave, and lots of counter space. The master stateroom contains a queen-sized bed, a wardrobe, cabinets, and an ensuite with shower. You'll also find a queen-sized bed in the guest stateroom and single beds elsewhere. Meanwhile, the expansive flybridge offers generous seating and lounging areas with a flawless combination of shade and sun, plus panoramic views. It's outfitted with light controls, fusion stereo, Garmin electronics, and more. Also on the flybridge is a teak dining table with seating for six people, a full beam sun lounge and an island grill wet bar with refrigerator in bottle storage. So you can really let loose or create a relaxing atmosphere as you float downstream. As with many modern houseboats, if you want to own it, you'll have to dig deep in your pocket. The most recent asking price for the Overblue houseboat was a whopping $949,000.
Which of these houseboat designs is your favorite? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like and check out our other videos if you haven't already. Make sure you subscribe to our channel for even more interesting and creative content. And hit that bell icon so you can stay up to date with our latest uploads. As always, thanks for watching, and we'll see you again next time.